think I've figured out a piece of the puzzle a little bit. Okay, you know that don't ask, don't tell thing in the military? Well, and all this gay pride and all this stuff. Well, it's almost like if you're a TI and you're being tortured by them, by the military or your fusion center from the cops, it's it's like gayness with technology. You know, they assault women who are normal, you know, because they just, I don't know, they just hate women, I guess. So there's this double standard going on. Um, I have never been, you know, um, this is my stance on it. It's like, I don't care if you're gay as long as it doesn't interfere in my life. But now that it's interfered in my life, uh, there's a gay agenda for them, and it's it's tied to this Freemasonry stuff. So it it goes it's all the way to the military, and they're using this thing I believe called the Raven Claw, which is designed by Raytheon. And I know that my handler is a cop. The one that tortures me. So, um, you know, we got we got a big mess going on, people. We have to prove. <clears throat> what we have to do is we have to. Um, it's like we have to go really dive into black ops and dismantle these agencies. Like the CIA is number one. The CIA is the one that gathers all the intel and the DNA. And it comes from hospitals and corporations that um, get this from children. Um, and, you know, wherever, you know, dentistry and everything. Um, this is how they're creating their hive mind. This is how they're creating, um, reading your thoughts. This is how corporations like Plantier Technologies has access to your brain thoughts. See, I don't understand how this shit works. I mean, it, you, it's like, you guys are sick. You must have, like, some fucked up brain. You're, you're psychopathic and you're serial killers. Because that's what this whole program is. You, you, you spray the planet with chemtrails, saturating the whole planet. Then you go after DNA frequency using that sun simulator shit in the sky. In your moon simulator. And then you have your neighbors uh, use ground-based um, LED lighting. And some of my neighbors probably have what's called the Ravenclaw in their house. These people have technology that they're walking around and, you know, zapping the shit out of people. Radiating them. This is not normal. Um, you know. And it's coming from that Bible code thing. You know, man created the Bible. Man wrote the Bible. It is man and it's na your neighbor you know, that's doing this, but, you know, a lot of these people are not human. A lot of them are not. You have, um, greys that are crossbreeding with, um, the human genetics, you know, because that's what, you know, they want to, Lucifer wants to destroy, um, mankind. And then once Lucifer's done with all of you working for him, he just throws you to the wayside anyways. So. You do realize that you're on your way to destroying yourselves, right? With this AI system. I mean, 
these machines are not normal. They're, they're, they're destroyers, so. And I know you have teleportation. I know you have jump room. It's all Star Trek, and Star Trek is based off Gene Roddenberry, who was a 33 degree Freemason, so. I just want this implant out. That's all I want. I'm tired of having my dreams and my thoughts hacked into by you, the military. I don't give a fuck about it. You know, if you all want to be hive-minded, I don't want to be hive-minded. I want to be outside the group. I don't give a fuck. Because I don't get the memo anyways, even with I'm part of your fucking gang. Your little alien bullshit. See, that's them. Those are the fucking Masons. And their bullshit, whatever. I just want this implant out. So if there's a doctor out there that knows how to get ocular implants out, that'd be great. Because I know the cops have ocular implants. I bet you anything, everybody is all fucking implanted. Everybody is. But I have been viciously assaulted with um, ocular implants. This is a military um, assault on humanity. And Lindsey Graham, Al Gore, Hillary Clinton... Uh, the McCain family, Rihanna from Hollywood, Joe Biden, all of you guys are fucking guilty of putting your bullshit on me. The Bush family, head of the CIA that had JFK murdered because he found out you guys were running a blood bank. Literally. The Bush family. The Bush family cabal. Who are not nice. They're reptilian, by the way. Because they have the fucking Giza technology, which is, you know, Pleiadian, which is fallen angel shit. So, I can go as high as you want, man. I can still go high. But, you know, this whole thing about, you know, the clown world and, you know, gay pride, I mean, pfft. That's fine. And I know that the gay pride people are using the, uh, they're using the Second Amendment because they go, well, we need to protect ourselves. Well, everybody needs to be protected. Don't single yourself out and think that you're better than everybody else just because you're gay. You know, I learned that a long time ago from a, mus a very high, excellent musician. Don't sit there and use your gay pride as an excuse to um, try and, you know, ban the guns or sit there and say, well, I have every right to defend myself. Everybody does. I'm defending myself now. What I don't like is your intrusion in uh, your, your, gay, your gay agenda being imposed upon me. Because I really don't give a fuck how you, how you do things. Like I said, I don't give a shit if you're gay as long as it doesn't interfere in my fucking life. Well, you know what? You have crossed hairs with me because you're Freemasons. Because I know who you are. You're Fraternal Order of Police. In the local uh, fusion center, you have your CIA fucking satellites over my house. I know who the fuck you are. You know what? I don't give a shit if you're a mud packer. Good for you. But that's not where it goes. I don't appreciate it at all that you're using the Second Amendment to um, impose your gayness. No one's coming after you.
It's just that you are, you know, flamboyantly putting it down the fucking street. Who gives a shit? With your rainbow uh, reptilian colors. I know what the rainbow represents. It represents uh, Lucifer, uh, scaly skin. Because if you add light to the skin of a reptilian, it shimmers like a rainbow. <laughs> 